Hi everyone, Madame St. Jacques here. I am going to walk you through logging into MyEdBC so that you can do your course selection. So uh, along with this uh, video, there is also a PDF that tells you all of the steps that you need to follow if you prefer to do that in print. So the first thing you're going to do is go to the shsscastlebar.com uh, website, that's our school website, and open it up at the home page. Look along the top tab and go to the tab that says for staff. You're gonna click on that tab and that's going to take us to the login page for my NBC. So you get to see all the lovely stuff. And then we scroll down and click visit my education BC. That is going to take you to your login ID. Login ID is for everyone, all lowercase, your first name, your last name, and your year of grad. Okay. Your password is going to be emailed to you on Monday and it is a combination of uppercase and lowercase letters and some numbers. It's probably easier to just do a cut and paste and you're going to find that in an email that went to either your sd20.net or your gmail account wherever you're retrieving your learning plans, parents, wherever you're receiving communications from us, that's where you will find the password. It's a uniquely generated and temporary password that you just cut and paste into this box and hit log on. That's going to bring you to this screen, which is fine. It tells you that your password has expired. Again, that's because it's a temporary one. So we'll okay that and cut and paste again, the same password that you just put onto the last page. That's the current one. And then we're going to create a new password. If you take a look up here, you'll see that the password requirements are, are uh, there's many of them. So we'll keep it simple for everyone. We'll go capital S, lowercase h, lowercase s, lowercase s, dollar sign, and then your student number, the one that you use to log on to the computer. And we'll do that again. Capital S, lowercase h, lowercase s, s, dollar sign, and then the number that you use to log on to the computer and okay that and that is going to bring you either to this page where it says my info or potentially to a page that asks you for uh, to put in a security question so you just go ahead and do that fill in the security question and when you submit it will bring you to this page and from here you'll be able to start doing your course selection. Check out the PDF. If uh, you have any questions, make sure that you're calling or emailing us so that we can help you get ready for course selection on Monday. Good luck, everybody, and we'll see you soon, I hope.